Well, this weekend, a lantern festival that you have to see to believe is coming back to the Milwaukee area. And Mallory, the blog Milwaukee with Kids says China Lights at Verner Botanical Gardens is sure to wow all the kids. Absolutely, and that is just one of a couple festivals happening this weekend for families around Milwaukee, plus a Sunday family fun day, free family fun happening at Summerfest grounds. Callie Herbst, great to see you again and talk about all of the weekend picks that the blog Milwaukee with Kids has for families this weekend. Something that is here and returning this Sunday is Sunday Family Fun Day at Northwestern Mutual Community Park. Yeah, and it's actually the last one. So they've done a series of them throughout the summer, but this is the last one. So it's kind of your last chance to take advantage of one of these. They're really fun. They're down by the new giant playground. And this theme, uh, this week's theme is performing arts in Milwaukee. So they have lots of member groups coming to do live performances. They'll have food trucks. They always have lots of interactive activities. And, you know, just to emphasize, it's free admission and then it's free parking, too. So I think it's lot G, um, but you just walk right into the Summerfest grounds. That playground is amazing. Kids love it. We're talking about it a lot when we do these features. So I think the families will have a blast on Sunday. Also happening this weekend, it is finally the return of China Lights at Burner Botanical Gardens. And this is a family favorite. So, you know, they've been coming for many consecutive years, but this year is theme is nature's glow and it looks so cool so it's focusing on biodiversity um ocean animals jungle animals i think the kids are really going to love a 20 foot tall octopus that they can walk through a 20 foot long t-rex that they can walk through just all kinds of features we are definitely going this year it looks awesome i got a little sneak peek when they were doing a preview setting up all of the beautiful lanterns there's a huge volcano there so so many things that the kids will just be in awe of when they see it plus the parents you can't go wrong for the family events also this weekend is the wine and harvest festival in downtown cedarburg and this is something you can definitely bring your kids to and if you are a parent that wants a little wine you can have that as well it's definitely for all ages so for kids there's a kids corner where they'll have a petting zoo and bounce houses and a barrel train um definitely a lot to do for the kids i know they have a classic car show one of the fun, really fun things they do is this giant pumpkin regatta so there's like these giant pumpkins floating down the river and people are rowing in them and they're decorated obviously they do like grape stomping and just lots of live music in the beautiful historic Cedarburg backdrop. This is another festival that they do every year and it's a lot of fun. Kicking off the fall season with a really great event that I'm sure everybody will enjoy. Callie, thanks so much for joining us again, breaking down those weekend picks with Milwaukee with Kids. Thank you. And here's an exclusive look at this year's China Lights from News Chopper 12. Take a look at all of those beautiful lanterns. It's going to be even more majestic at nighttime. The display is open Friday through October 29th. Also, if you missed the Kite Festival at Milwaukee's Lakeshore last weekend, you have another chance to see some amazing kites this weekend in Greendale. We have all the information on that event, plus everything we just talked about on the 12 News app. Just search Milwaukee with Kids. I love that. Mm -hmm. I think it's so cool. I mean, the Lantern Festival is amazing. I really have to make a trip to Cedarburg. Yes. I have to do mm -hmm. it this year. Have you not gone ever? I have not. Oh, my no. gosh. So oh, yeah. I know, I know. It's so been something that so many and... people have talked about and, and just how unique and historic it is. So yeah. prepare yeah. yourself for list. a crowd yeah. Yeah. if you go during a festival right. weekend. Yeah. But it's always fun to go there. There's so much good food. Oh, I could just go on. And the weather's going to be, be great. Good weather for it, yeah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Jinx. Great mind. <laughs>